let's see uh, question 14th again it's like objective problem ex objective solved example question 14th functions this time I'll use a graphical approach see the question is we have to find number of solutions of this had it been find the solutions of this this approach might not have been a good approach as we are supposed to find number of solutions what we are going to do is we will draw graph of this and graph of this and find points of intersection in, in right half or in fact for x between root 2 and root 3 right you know this is the graph of 1 by x in right half to draw fractional part of 1 by x we draw horizontal line 1 right and then we draw 2 and goes on but we are not bothered about these lines because we have to be on right of 1 this point of intersection is 1 between 1 by x and 1 so the intersection of the 2 is at x equal to 1 we don't need not go into this now you know what we do right uh, like uh, from 1 to infinity in fact every section between every section like suppose this is a two line this is half so between two consecutive points of intersection between these two consecutive values we have to bring this section now this is what we do like this we draw it like this and we replace fx by fractional part of fx so every section we bring it down but there is no complexity just like this. This is the graph of fractional part of 1 by x on, on right of 1. I draw it separately. Right. Now if you look at x square fractional part of x we draw one line, two line, three line goes on. Points of intersection 1 root 2 root 3 now between two consecutive points of intersection we have to bring sections down we will bring this section down open at top bring this section down open at top so this is the graph between root 2 and root 3 so if you just plot here this is 2 this is 3 so root 2 and root 3 is between 1 and 2 right so if you draw graph of this between root 2 and root 3 it will be like this so you can see between root 2 and root 3 th there will be only one point of intersection between the two graphs so number of positive solutions equals to 1 right so what I have done I just repeat that I draw graph of uh, fractional part of 1 by x between root 2 and root 3 right for that I, I draw one line and like say two three line but need not may not plot that because we have to be in this region and between these two lines fraction part of 1 by x is this graph is same as 1 by x in case of x square also I have drawn graph between root 2 and root 3 that is this section will bring it down between 0 and 1 so you have to, to know how I have done this what I have done this you need to go and revise transformation fx to fractional part of fx right and after plotting the two in between root 2 and root 3 I can see the two graphs meet at one point so there is one point of intersection between them